Hello and happy Thanksgiving from the Hobby Farm Guys. I'm Steve. And I'm Brian. And preparing dinner behind the scenes is Eric. Happy Thanksgiving. I don't think he's making dinner. It looks like he's watching football. Well, what are we going to eat? Go! <laughs> that kind of football. <laughs> How about we just get to our video? Yeah, let's go. So here in the United States, we set aside the third Thursday each November to give thanks. Typically, families gather together, and part of the traditional celebration includes a turkey dinner. And since many hobby farmers raise turkeys, or are interested in raising turkeys, we thought we'd have some fun with our YouTube family and share 10 fun facts about turkeys you may not have known. Right? Fun fact number one. Turkeys may look awkward, but they're fast. Actually, very fast. So domestic breeds have lost some of that speed. Okay, most of it. <laughs> um, but wild turkeys can reach 25 miles an hour on the ground and a whopping 55 miles an hour in flight for sh over short distances. Yeah. Our second fact, that red droopy bit of flesh on top of a turkey's beak, it's called a snood. Both males and females have one, but for the males it's particularly important. A 1997 study showed females were more attracted to toms with larger snoods and toms were more likely to defer to others with larger snoods. Fun fact number three, turkeys make lots of different sounds, right? They're known to cluck, yelp, and even purr, but the sound most associated with the turkey is the gobble. Although it's actually only the males that will gobble. Yeah. They do so to announce themselves to potential mates and to try and scare away other males. Yeah. Fact number four, although there are distinct differences between breeds, those differences are all the result of selective breeding. All turkeys, domestic and wild, are the same species, Milagris galapapho. Right, and our fifth fun fact is based on the domestication of turkeys. Many assumed it was European settlers who domesticated the wild turkey after arriving in North America. In fact, Native Americans had already pretty much domesticated the bird and were keeping their own flocks. Yeah. Now, speaking of Europeans, fact number six relates to the name turkey. Most historians agree the name of this bird comes from the country turkey. Although the bird's not native to that land, Many Europeans bought the turkeys through the merchants in Constantinople, now Istanbul, and the bird became associated with that region. Fun fact number seven. It's hard to tell the sex of turkeys until they're actually quite a few months old, yeah. right? Uh, there are some uh, often unreliable indicators that you might be able to sex them, uh, for example, by their poop, yeah. right? A spiraled stool is likely a female, while the elongated J is likely a male. Yeah. Now, fact number eight which may not be so fun, is that males can get quite aggressive when they're ready to mate. By aggressive, I mean they might even attack a much larger animal or a car, including you, just to impress a female. So be careful around your toms when they're in the mood. Uh, fact number nine. Although estimates place uh, the wild turkey population at over 7 million in the U.S., uh, less than 100 years ago, wild turkeys were threatened with extinction. Uh, due to hunting and loss of habitat, uh, there were believed to be fewer than 30,000 left in 1930. And our last fun fact about turkeys is, despite what many Americans have come to believe, Benjamin Franklin was never known to actually suggest the turkey become our national bird. He did remark about how majestic a bird it is, but never really went so far as to say it should be our national bird. Well, what do you think? Did you learn something interesting about turkeys? All right, if you have any other interesting facts, let us know in the comments. Until next time, happy Thanksgiving and happy hobby farming. Bye. Oh, come on! Tackle him already! <laughs> hey everybody, Steve here with Hobby Farm Guys. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please consider subscribing to our channel and liking our videos. Uh, we continue to post new videos every Thursday. Uh, leave us comments down below. Let us know what you'd like to see. In the meantime, happy hobby farming.